Uh, nice to score, but um, you know, obviously even better uh, the win tonight. Um, you know, we've been doing the right things lately and haven't been able to get the results. So, uh, you know, there's a big one for us tonight. We needed it. Um, you know, and it's a, a step in the right direction. How are you gonna thinking to pass, or is thinking you'd fool them? Uh, I don't know what I was thinking to be honest with you. I was just. I try not to think too much out there. It gets me in trouble usually. So uh, he just, you know, he took it away, he took the pass away, and uh, you know, I seen a chance to shoot. So you know, we're on the PK too. So I want to, you know, you don't want to pass and have it sent back the other way too. So yeah, you, you, you know, you look at our, you know, what's been going on lately. It's you know, it's easy just to, you know, get down by one and end the fold. But uh, you know, this team, we've, you know, we've, we've been telling each other that we're a good team, and you know, it's gonna, the results are gonna go the right way. So um, you know. We stuck with it. Now it's time to, uh, you know, the build off of this. Uh, the defense doing his try as far as trying to help out offensively here tonight. Um, I mean, nothing, you know, really different going into the night. I guess just trying to jump in the play when we can. Um, I, I just uh, happened to get up in the play and get a chance from Z there. He made a, a nice little play uh, around the defenseman to kind of open up some room for me. And then Dale's just, um, you know, just jumped up there and had, had time and space, so he kept going. It was nice to see. Do you think you guys have shown some mental toughness this week in, in keeping doing the right things even when, you know, the results have been not going against you? Yeah, um, you know, you guys know the last few games were kind of tough for us, uh, those OT losses. So, you know, it's the only thing you do is keep uh, sticking with it. Um, we played well in those games. We've played well, you know, in, I don't know, maybe the last four four games or something like that and weren't seeing results. So um, just sticking with it is really the only thing you can do. Just a bit of a relief for you that you got the first one out of the way? Yeah, definitely. Um, I mean, the last few games, I started to feel a little bit better on the ice there, and um, I thought I had a little, a little bit more jump and getting up into the play a little bit more. So um, I'm just going to try to keep that going, and definitely any time you score, it um, gives you a confidence boost. Yeah, I mean, uh, we're aggressive. Uh, you know, we're smart. Uh, you know, we're, uh, uh, you know, we give up our bodies out there to block shots, and uh, you know, because of that, the guys are getting rewarded. You know, the last couple of games, you know, there's some unfortunate bounces and they wound up in back right now. And now, uh, you know, tonight, uh, you know, we, uh, you know, we finished it out. Uh, you know, we went out there and uh, continued to play in the third period. And, uh, you know, we were able to come up with two points. Trevor Daly's first as a wing turns out to be a game winner. How do the guys in the room feel for him finally getting his and it being uh, in that fashion? It's, uh, it's great. Uh, you know, he's a great addition here to our dressing room. He's a great guy. He works hard, you know, every single day. So it's, uh, you know, great to see him, uh, you know, finally find the back of the net. Yeah, he, he played. He played outstanding. Um, you know, he's a type of a player who steps up in this situation. That's why he's one of the best. And he he picked up many points in NHL. So I mean, you know, he he knows when to step up. What was the thought on your goal? Did you go straight to that, knowing that might happen, or what were you thinking on that play as it developed? Uh, yeah, I saw Hank pick up a lot of speed on the side, and uh, I kind of saw like he had that guy beat. So I just tried beat my guy and try to go for a rebound. You know, maybe bounce bounce off the of the pad. So I mean, he he passes pretty pretty good on a stick. So I mean, yeah. I think so. yeah so it was a nice play by him. Tomasha, you said after last game, it's almost hard to talk about how much easier is it tonight having done the right things and getting that result. Yeah, for sure. You, know, you can see me smile. It's uh, it's a great feeling to to have a win. You know, uh, you know we have to build on this. Uh, a lot of guys feel way better right now, and it's just like I said, it's a, it's a way way better feeling after the game when you when you end up winning. So I mean, you know, we have to keep it up. Uh, the other day is uh, tomorrow, and we have to work hard. Do you think I think you know results. Results help you. They make you feel better about yourself. We need points, so um, I think from a confidence standpoint, when you get results, it helps. I think from a, from a point standpoint, we need all the points we can get. Um, you know, I don't think our, our our process was a whole lot different than it's been, if any. Um, uh, but we found the way to, to get the two points. So as I said, uh, after the last number of games, we've got to stay with the exact same process come Tuesday night. And if you can't keep doing it over and over and over and over and over again, you're going to get. The results you need. I mean, it's a, it's a, it would be a big definition, I guess. Uh, you know, like, like here's the thing. Here's the thing. If you talk to my wife, she would tell you that I'm very long-winded, so we could be here for a while. So it's, it's managing the puck. Uh, it's um, for us. It's managing the puck. It's getting on on people with great pressure. It's playing fast, uh, coming up the ice and using our speed and putting other teams under heels and doing it right, shift by shift. You know, I've got a thing. Every shift, we got to outwork, out compete, and out detail our opponent. So, I mean, that's to me the the process of it. And 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 what when I talk about it. 
I think it's easy uh, from a human emotion standpoint um, to let the outcome of the game dictate how you feel about your how your team played, uh, both from a fan perspective, a reporter perspective, and a coach perspective. And then I've always been somebody that, that really felt strongly that you have to make sure that you don't let the emotions of wins and losses cloud your vision of how you played. And, and, and that goes with wins just as much with losses. And so that's where we, that's why we pour over film. That's why we uh, look at ch scoring chances. Scoring chances to me always tell the story of the game, and if you outchance your opponents, m most times you're going to win. So basically, judge the performance more than the result. Correct.